Hey guys, this is Creator Creator here, and I'm about to show you how to create a LAN server. Um, first off, uh, it will, it's basically a home server, but in well, technical terms, a LAN server. It's basically only people that can use your internet that are connect that can connect to your internet only can um join your server or will be able to. So first off, you want to go to um Minecraft.net, log in, or oh, don't have to. Um, click download and then click on under here for windows minecraft underscore, underscore server dot xe click on that download it when you've downloaded it it will come up with this is my minecraft server here this except on your desktop here or wherever you put it um put a new file like minecraft server put it into there and then start it up and then all of these sorry all of these will um just appear there I don't know what, why that's there. Um, that shouldn't. Anyway, uh, there's, there's going to be a file that says server. If that doesn't have anything on it, if there's no program to run it, just double click on it and it will say choose a program. You want to go, this is just another way, and then click on the notepad that should be there. If that's not there, then there's something wrong. Okay, okay. And once you're in, you see all of these things are allowed now the true True basically means, um, yes, like, allow it, yes, or enforce means no, if it wasn't obvious enough. Um, allow fire, false, false, whatever. Uh, level seed, if you know what seed means, if you don't, look it up on Google or YouTube, look it up. Um, server I like height, true, false, true. Online mode, you want to change that to false, okay? Change the online world to false. Now, I know this looks like a lot of things to do, except it's really not that easy, just do it step by step how I'm telling you. So, really simple. PvP, that means player versus player, if you do know that. Difficulty, zero means no difficulty, which would be peaceful, up to, um, three, which would be high. Game mode, zero, that means survival one is creative. Max players, that's obvious enough. Spawn monsters, generate structures, which is like NPC villages, uh, view distance, ten, doesn't really make sense because I can see more than 10 blocks away. Anyway, so you can get out of that and whatever, so, but it won't work because you need your server IP. Now what you need to do is, is you need to go into here. With Windows 7, you can just type in CMD and it'll come up. Uh, with Windows, with Windows XP, there'd be a run file. Do something like this down the side. Just click on that. Go into that. Token CMD. I'm not sure with Vista though. I think there's a search thing here. I think you can just do CMD or you can do the long way and do run enter CMD enter. When you go into this, click enter and then what you want to type in is IP config. Now I don't really want to show you that because I've heard about hacking and stuff. I don't know if that's true. Comment if it's not true because then this whole thing would be puzzle. But anyway, you'd come up with something that looks like this. Well, exactly like this. Oh. Not exactly, though. No. Now, you want to know your IP IP address. Right here, IP address. Go through the lines. Right here. This isn't going to be yours, but whatever it says here, you're going to put onto your server IP. Okay? Put that onto it. When you and Now, when you're done with that, once you've put it onto your server IP, exit out of it. Press save. Minus. Go into Minecraft. Log in. May take a bit, I'm sorry. I'll skip it. And then you'd go multiplayer. Now you can add a server, put in your server name and then your IP address that you had before, or direct direct connect, and then just put in the IP that you found that you found, um, sorry, that you found here, and that you put into, and the one that you put into the notepad before. Then you've got on that, and now say if you had a laptop next to another computer with a modem, like if you had a modem, another computer, or a laptop of some sort that, that could connect to your internet, they could just go onto the server as well, and then you two, two, three, four, up to whatever number you chose, can all play together. Thanks guys for watching and this is just a really simple way how to um, 
make a land server. Uh, if there's anything I've missed, please post it in the comments. If you have any questions, put it in the comments. Like, fave, sub. Okay. Thank you, bye. Yeah. Bye.